the newest exhibit at the Jeep Rescue League Museum in Swatch, Colorado. Uh, I had run across this picture of an early military mobile uh, maintenance repair station. These were set up to do maintenance on weapon systems. Uh, you won't find any of the originals. It was actually, this one was built on an FWD early heavy truck. Uh, they're long gone, really hard to find, except for, guess what, old Bob found me one. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah, and it doesn't have a body, but it has the front half. Now, so, Bob is BC Vintage Oh, yeah, Jeep the, the Bob. one and only. Right, right. <laughs> Bad Bob. <laughs> right. So uh, I built this up starting from just a bare frame because, like I say, you'll never find an original one. Uh, the military's terrible with that, like the Jeeps and everything else. When they're out of fashion, old, they just push them in a landfill somewhere or use them for a range practice. Um, but I did, looking at this, it's like, well, I think I can duplicate that. Having worked on base, we would get requests to build these types of equipment, not this old, but a modern version all the time. Uh, they had what they call a military work order, and that, if you got the colonel to sign off, you could build anything. And you would get orders in, they have some special application they need, but for something like this, that's what they would have done a hundred years ago too. They'd get an old truck that wasn't going to combat, but still run, so they could put that portable shop on it, and then they could do whatever they wanted on base. This one's set up just like those originals with most of the original type tools we would have used to maintain 1917 Eddie Stone military rifles, 03 Springfields, all that early stuff. Complete with belt driven lay or uh, drill press, the hand tools, and then you know, any kind of cupboard. So this doesn't look exactly like this one, but no two would have looked alike. They work so well that later on they just kept evolving and there's a whole family of different contact trucks for electronics, for weapons, for mechanics, machine shops. Uh, they've got big five-ton trucks that are a portable machine shop that you could do anything out of. Check out my other videos from the tour of the Jeep Rescue League in Swatch, Colorado in the description below. For more Jeep Life with Jeep Mama, head over to my blog at jeepmama.com.